Hi. So I'm working with a team on this project for Burning Man that involves using Connect, Ableton Live, and Quartz Composer. As the programmer on the team, I needed to enable my teammates to create cool content in these applications. So as a goal, I decided to see if I could create some tools that would allow people to easily create these dubstep Connect videos that I've seen on YouTube. Like this one. And this one. So I created these tools, and then I thought that maybe other people might like to use them as well. So I'm releasing them freely to the public. Here's the kind of things you can create with them. So, first of all, if you just want to play with this, you can get my app and a free Ableton Live trial and have it up and running in a matter of minutes. Head over to synapseconnect.tumblr.com to download. But what's exciting about this is not so much just that demonstration video, or that you can play with this sort of dubstep theremin. It's, that incre it's incredibly easy to use these tools to control whatever you want to enable them live. Here's a quick demo of how easy it is. So I have a skeleton bound in Synapse, and I have a simple live set that just plays a sound effect over and over again. So say I wanted to use my left hand, uh, the height, to control the volume of that sound effect. So all I have to do is drop in uh, this Mac Connect dial patch, switch it to left hand, and I want to use the Y, the height, and then I will map it to the volume of that sound. And now you can see that my hand is controlling that volume knob, so I'll play it here. There you go. Now, so I also want to add a, a bit crusher effect that my, my hand's exposition controls. Uh, so I'll drop in a Redux object. I will drop in another Max Connect dial, set it to the left hand, and I'll leave it on X, and then I'll map that to the down sample rate. And when I play it, you can hear my hand's in control. My right hand, my left hand's exposition is in control of the down sample, and the height is the volume. And there you go. So hopefully, some people who are talented with Ableton will get a hold of this and make some really awesome stuff. Check out my other videos for more detailed tutorials on how to use Synapse to control Ableton Live and Quartz Composer, and head to synapseconnect.tumblr.com for more info and to download it. Thanks. <laughs>